Welcome everybody to Digital Transformation in Copenhagen, where we're focused on providing the AI-driven telecom. And we have with us today two very special guests with Sara and Samer. Could you please introduce yourselves? Sure, Sara Coppo, based in Italy. BMC Helix is my company, and I'm a telco programs lead in BMC Helix. Thank you so much, Samer. Uh, I'm Samer, I head up our uh, telco strategic industry software partnerships for the Europe, Middle East and Africa region for Google Cloud. Well, it's great that you're both here and it's really fun to be in Copenhagen, but it's not just all fun. There's a lot of work going on and that work is taking place in our Catalyst projects. So, sorry, can you identify kind of the challenge that you guys are addressing? What's the, what's the Catalyst project name? What's the challenge you're addressing? Yeah, the catalyst uh, that we are doing uh, this year, I'm not going to tell you the name, it's just too long, but basically is a part of the autonomous network um, uh, path. And uh, we are doing it with uh, lots of uh, communication service providers uh, and mainly with the uh, one called the DMB, Digital National Bear Hard. Uh, we've got, of course, uh, you know, other participants uh, like uh, uh, Tekem. And uh, uh, what uh, we are uh, uh, presenting is a solution which uh, um, it's uh, to uh, improve the efficiency of uh, DMB. Okay, DMB in Malaysia, it's a, uh, basically a wholesale. So they uh, uh, manage the uh, radio infrastructure for all the mobile network operators in the country, there's six of them. So the challenge is obviously keeping the RAN going. Uh, and also dealing with the, the mobile network operators who have got their own uh, customers. So they are kind of like in the middle, you know, they've got uh, the MNO when there is a problem on the radio access, uh, uh, some of their customers uh, is not able to make calls uh, or the handover is not working, they will call the MNO and the MNO needs to ask DMB what's going on, when this is going to be fixed. So the solution that we have proposed is using uh, Agentic. Of course, also uh, Google uh, is part of the, of the ecosystem of uh, DMB. So we are working together to provide uh, a, a solution to their problem, which is having uh, a interface between a DMB and the MNO, which is very fragmented. The data is not in real time, it's scattered all over. And with Agentic, we are bringing everything together to provide uh, a better customer experience, experience to the MNOs and ultimately to the customers of the MNOs. Well, and, and a lot of the conference right now is about bringing autonomous networks to the operators to help improve those efficiencies and those communications. And AI is a big part of that. So when you look at how that integrates, kind of architecturally, how have you set that, the data side of things? How have you looked at it from an agent perspective? What kind of tools are you leveraging? Um, as we mentioned, you know, they've, they've got, uh, they're using uh, uh, Google, okay, then uh, uh, they are also a user of our solution, VMC uh, Helix, and uh, uh, the way that uh, we have looked at the solution is to really provide a gen tech across all the different uh, domain, the different layers. I'm referring to uh, this kind of like a new um, view of autonomous network framework, which includes a resource domain, service domain, and business domain. And because what we call customer loop, which is ultimately what we are trying to achieve, close the loop from when the customer is experiencing the issue to when the issue is resolved with the customer being notified, the SLA not being breached, uh, we do uh, we do that uh, uh, really working uh, with Agentic at all the three different uh, uh, layers. Well, it's amazing. It's, it's leveraging AI to really discover and, and close the loop and bring that better customer experience. Yeah. And, and that's tremendous. And I know it takes partnership to do that. Summer, what about the partnership is, is really speaking to us and how are we strengthening that? I think it's fantastic what we've managed to do with BMC in less, probably less than two years where we started club collaborating on uh, with BMC Helix products specifically in the, I, in the ITSM space with telcos, both in the IT domain and the networks domain. We then elevated that using making use of uh, Google's Vertex AI tooling and, uh, and, and Gemini 
and this is now evolving with with all of the kind of focus the industry is getting on autonomous network operations, intent-based automation, and closing the loop to resolution. So I think there's an evolution of the partnership as we've progressed with with BNC. Very strong co-sell motion globally. Definitely in my in in kind of my region in EMEA, there's there's two or three telcos that we signed up jointly, and there's more to come in the pipeline. There's more focus in North America as well. And we're getting a focus with DMB in Asia. So globally, I think that partnership is evolving. The teams are working very well together. And the products are starting to really feel like they're integrated uh, compared to maybe where we were two years ago. So I think uh, it's it's one of those partnerships that I think is, is quite a flagship partnership for us at Google. Well, we love to see that. And Sarah, it's great to see that that partnership. And one of the things, as you mentioned, Simon, was Vertex AI. And it becomes about choice too. So we have our you know, flagship large language model with Gemini. You have Vertex AI that can present in many more. How do you feel about the choice that you have as a partner when you look at that kind of architecture? Well, uh, I think that, uh, you know, the, the, the main point here is that uh, with the CSPs, uh, they are starting now with Agentic to really embrace uh, AI. AI has been around for what, two, three years, okay? But, uh, and I was discussing with Summer earlier, um, uh, there was a webinar, the TM Forum webinar, and there was a, a, a VP in a big uh, telco uh, in Europe saying, well, with AI, we really see the, um, uh, with Agentic, we really see the time, they it called it like the inflection point, when uh, really CSPs, uh, they understand that they needed to add AI to their strategy. And when we talk about AI and the Gentech, BMC has the, uh, have the tools, uh, but uh, the Google, it's, uh, it's key. So this is why I think to me, it really works. Uh, it, 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 it's an ecosystem where you've got uh, Google, you've got uh, Helix, and of course, you know, this uh, to provide uh, a solution to go through that uh, evolution to level four, at least, and then five in many more years. Uh, in the autonomous network uh, uh, operations. Well, I tell you what, it's been exciting. We're happy to have this partnership working in that catalyst and, and all the great work that you're doing within the industry. And I appreciate you guys uh, being here to share. So, Sarah, Samra, thank you so much. Thanks, man. And that's it for now from Copenhagen at Digital Transformation World. Mm -hmm.